So this video is going to be the next one, which is Professor Lupin's. So you can see it's a black box. It says Professor Lupin right there. I'm going to open up the box. On the inside, you see, there's styrofoam. And the wand. I actually don't have the wand pushed in correctly because I do have these wands displayed on my display case. So I'm just putting them in the boxes lightly like so to be able to show you how they did come. As you can see, the inside is a plastic holder. It's a black plastic holder. And the inside of the box is white. Not sure you can see it, but you can see it on this side that it is a white box. So here is the wand. Not that heavy. It's actually pretty light. I really don't like holding this wand because it is light and I'm not sure about it. I have other ones that I prefer holding. See, the ball is really small, but it is a nice fit. You can see how he would use the wand. Nice small ball at the end. You can see the grooves and the ridges somewhat in this video. And then you see two lines to separate the rest of the handle. There is the trademark right there. And the rest of the wand, it is a brown wand, just like most of wands that have been made. This wand actually did come from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Not sure what number one this was that I bought, but I did buy it the second time I went to the park. Not my favorite wand, but not too much detail work, not a lot to it. Just plain and simple. Until the next video, thanks for watching.